The Gauteng Transport Department has set aside 23 billion rand to develop and maintain roads. This is part of their 10-year development plan. The private sector is set to contribute more than 5 billion rand. The Transport Department says 67 priority projects are currently underway and all projects are set to be concluded in 2030. ENCA's Linda Kutlik-Kudu reports. An all-inclusive transport infrastructure house project has been launched by the Gauteng Transport Department. Over 67 projects with a budget of 23 billion aims to create smart mobility in the province by improving infrastructure across board. Roads, building new ones, maintaining roads, taxi ranks as infrastructure to support the taxi industry, rail, expanding it even into townships, the projects also include road maintenance. Mamabulo says the department will be dedicating Fridays to this. We will be wearing overalls, patching roads, and we will not do it as a once-off. We will do it until the current term comes to an end, every year, every Friday. Mamabulo has also warned contractors that will be working with the department. Because they are in a rush, they're making money. Tomorrow the rain comes, the same pothole we have sorted is now back to square one. And we have paid. So we are going to have to crack the whip on the quality of patching potholes. It must be done correctly. Not cutting the corners and not rushing behind money-making uh, initiatives and schemes. He also didn't hold back on the issues of etols. The Transport MEC says suggestions have been made to the National Transport Department to find other ways of billing that don't burden residents in the province. The payment of these roads and any system that comes must be a system that starts from the point of view that says these are national roads. The project set to end in 2030 will also see the expansion of how train routes to both Mamelodi and Soweto. Lindogu Shekulu, Johannesburg.